Hi, I'm Herb Stevens at Sunday River, Maine, and this week I'd like to tell you about a little-known atmospheric factor that plays a big role in determining what kind of winter we're going to have here in the Northeast. It's the QBO, a mouthful, a quasi-biennial oscillation. It's a phenomenon where the stratospheric winds, the top 5% or so of the atmosphere, switch back and forth from west to east, then east to west, every two and a half years or so. Now that's a long ways from here, but those two wind directions can have distinctly different impacts on winter weather in the Northeast. We are now in a positive or westerly QBO. In general terms, a westerly QBO brings the Northeast its biggest snow years. Westerlies also favor a positive PNA, which consists of a western ridge and an eastern trough, and that combination leads to cold and snow where we like it, on the slopes of the Northeast. An easterly QBO favors broad cold across the whole country, but a westerly also delivers the cold to our region. Early this week, we had a storm that none of us were too happy about, but I'm telling you, you give those groomers three days on the slopes with those fancy machines, the skiing and riding will be just fine by this weekend. Here are the details. If you only have one day to ski or ride this weekend, Sunday will definitely be the better day. The snowmakers have been busy resurfacing the trails for the past four days at Sunday River, Saddleback, and Sugarloaf in Maine. Saturday does look messy, but there will not be a hard freeze on Sunday. You can snowshoe or cross-country ski for free this Saturday at King Pine up by North Conway. Cranmore's crew has been working around the clock to rehab their slopes this week. The mild weather on Saturday could actually allow Wildcat, Attach, and Bretton Woods to open up a few trails that got locked up in the early week freeze. Mount Sunapee and Gunstock in the Lakes region of New Hampshire have plenty of open terrain for everyone from rank beginners to seasoned experts. Cannon has a rail jam scheduled for this Saturday. They have plenty of open top to bottom runs to test your legs, as do Loon Mountain and Waterville. Up in the eastern townships of Quebec, rain on Saturday will end as some accumulating snow at Mount Sutton and Owl's Head. I'm Herb Stevens, a skiing weatherman, enjoying some fine sliding at Sunday River. I'll be back next week with a look at the forecast for the long MLK weekend.